Hi guys, it's Fran, back with your video of the week. Okay, so this week I want to talk to you about waiting. 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 When I was younger, many years of my life, many years of my adult life, I was always waiting for something to happen. I was waiting on God to give me a sign. I was waiting on God to move in my life. I was waiting on God to do this or send me a husband or, or, or make my bank account full. Or I was always waiting. I was waiting. I was waiting. But I wasn't being proactive in my life. I would talk to God, but I wouldn't listen to God. I would go to church on Sunday, but then the rest of the week, I put God on the shelf because I really wasn't ready to do what God was calling me to do. I really wasn't ready to set my physical self aside and become a vessel and allow God to use me. So my excuse was I was waiting. So for all those years, I was never living on purpose because I was waiting I was waiting for that big voice. I was waiting on that big white light to appear in my bedroom. I was waiting on God to do something that he had already done in me. You see, you are created to do exactly what it is that God has purposed you to do. You don't have to wait for any sign because if you feel it in your spirit and you feel it in your heart, that's your sign. If it makes you happy, that's your sign. If you do it easily and effortlessly, that is your sign. We spend a lot of time waiting, waiting on things that never happen. We spend a lot of time looking for the sign, looking for it out here. It's already within you. The Spirit of God runs through each and every one of us. The Spirit of God talks to, ministers to, guides each and every one of us every single day of our lives. All we have to do is pay attention. Sometimes, if you're not hearing clearly, God will send somebody across your path and tell you exactly what you need to know and leave you in a state of, whoa, right? God is always, always present. You don't have to wait. Get on with it. Life is moving. You're either going to get on board or you're going to get left behind. You're going to be that, that person that's sitting in the chair saying, I wish I would have. I wish I should have. I knew I should have. I knew I could have. I should have did it. Just do it. Trust your journey. Trust God. Know that if you put one step forward, God will take 10 steps with you. Stop waiting. Live now. That's the message of the week, guys. Have a great day. Bye.